Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem twenty one in chapter twenty five. Chapter twenty five is electric current and resistance. So you there you can see we have two aluminum wires have the same resistance. So we can write down there are two wire two wires right R one equal to R two, and then it tell you if one has twice the length of the as the other. So we think the L one. Over L two equal to two, so the L one has twice the length of the L two, right? Ask you what is the ratio of the diameter of the longer wire to the diameter of the shorter one? So you can see the longer one is L one. So this way we can see the you ask you to find the ratio for D one over D two. Agree? Yes. So there you can see the quantities has some relationship with the resistance. The length and the diameter. So very straightforward. We can consider the function as the resistance equal to resistivity times L divided by E, right? And rho is just the resistivity depend on materials that are identical aluminum. And L is the length. A is the cross section area. So pi r square. So this radius can be replaced as the diameter over two. Agree? Simplified, you can find the function for R, right? Now ask you to find the ratio of the diameters. So very straightforward, we can get the function for diameters from this equation R equal to this term. So you solve it, you can get the function for D, right? Now you can see we look at the ratio d one over d two. We replace d one as the this term l one over r one. Similarly for d two, you can see four rho four rho cancelled, pi pi cancelled. So we can simplify the term. Look like this one. In this function, you can see tell you r one equal to r two. So this can cancel. Finally, you get the term as the squared L one over L two. Input the term L one over L two as two inside. You get the final answer there. Thank you.